All right, guys, today I want to walk you through a uh, standard, typical uh, gas-fired furnace and maybe do some uh, uh, deconstruction work here, walk you through schematics. Uh, this is a super popular uh, furnace. You're going to see a ton of these. Uh, this particular one's a 90,000 BTU Bryant uh, gas flow furnace. It can either be in an upflow configuration or you can set the furnace on its side and be a horizontal uh, discharge. Uh, the important thing to remember on furnaces is they basically made up of three systems into one. Uh, number one is the blower system. You got a blower wheel in here that pulls air either through the bottom of the furnace or it can even go through the side, gets filtered, pushes the air past our uh, uh, burners and heat exchanger, hot air comes out the top. That's one system. Second system is the combustion air, where we use a combustion fan motor, pressure switch, a couple safety controls, and we run the small blower motor, we pull air in through our burners, get exhausted out through the flue pipe, and we keep our combustion air system moving that way. Third system on here is our uh, gas uh, heating system safeties and controls. Uh, our uh, electronics board, our gas valve, uh, our ignition system are all part of that. So when you're diagnosing, you want to approach a furnace that way by knowing that there's three separate systems. Try to define where your problem is. Is it in the air moving system? Is it in the combustion air system? Or is it in your gas train and controls and safety system? One of those three is where you're going to find that problem. 